Hello everyone, it's Alex. Today I'm going to show you quickly how to use uh, a small feature but that may help you uh, a lot if you are doing some project that needs to capture user information and to keep it while uh, the application is still running. So this is an example here. This is a simple project. This white area here is a canvas, so you are able to, to draw things. It's a regular canvas thing. Okay, uh, you can switch colors if you want. But the beauty here is, with this new feature that I'm gonna show you in a few seconds, when you go next, if you decide later on, while you're running the app, come back to the following page, the image that you drew before will be there. Okay, so you can come here again and do opposite things and go back. What this feature does is pretty much save uh, a picture a JPEG of the the last drawing that you did and when you need to clean up again you can do a reload and if later on you decide to close this app and open again uh, it will come up with a blank canvas again if the, the, the file does not exist anymore in the temporary uh, directory so let me show you how it works so in this project here it's again it's a very simple project I have this canvas copy area here, which is this, this blank screen. It will act as a canvas. And I came here to the interactions, select set canvas, and it has created for me. So you have all the information captured, the brush color and things like that. So this is the new buttons, the, the, the auto save. When you enable auto save, what it will do is to, every time that you switch page, uh, the copy of the canvas area will be saved on your device's temporary directory. So while you will go back to this to to the the same screen later on in your project, because the, this file still exists in a temporary folder, it will load quick will load it for you. So this way you can keep continue tracking your 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 drawing. Okay, so there are uh, th there are a few tweaks here. For example, Corona does not allow us to save as PNG on iOS. So if you have a complex design here, what will require uh, you know always the the strokes of your drawing be on top of everything like the original canvas do. Uh, it will not work because it will be replaced by this JPEG image. Also, if you have some you know curve uh, canvas areas probably you're gonna have some some issues with uh, this auto feature because again uh, it's just a jpeg that corona scan can in, in fact it's not even corona it's uh, as far as i know it's uh, ios so uh, again let's 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 see if i disable this okay i'm gonna save here i don't need to export humans anymore and publish let's take a look so can draw, you go next, you return, there's nothing here. That's the way it's uh, rendered uh, in Quick re regularly. But if you come back, if we come back here and enable the auto save canvas again and publish again, okay, we can draw here now, go to next, and here is our drawing as expected. Simple as that. Hope you like. Thank you.